Tiger Man is, in the first place, a story about fatherhood, but it's a, also a thriller. It's a guy who gets sent to an island with a brief which is very simple. You may not see what is happening here. Uh, the island is about to be destroyed for various reasons, so there's a, a whole community of illegal, unlawful, criminal, geopolitical things happening just offshore, and he is to see none of it. And that's all he has to do. In the meantime, though, he makes friends with a local kid who he wants to adopt when the island is evacuated. And the kid wants him to see all of it, wants him to see everything. So he is, in the first place, a man with a problem. And in consequence of really of that tension, he finds himself doing more and more extraordinary things in an effort to prove to the boy that the world is a fair place and to make it a little bit into a fairer place as well. And that ultimately involves him putting on what is, to all intents and purposes, a superhero suit. Although he has no magic powers, no, no, he's not mountainously rich or anything like that. He's just a guy. And this leads them both into a, a, an ever more dangerous situation and a darker and darker view of the world. Um, which is not to say that I'm not having any fun. I, I'm incapable of telling stories without trying to make them funny. So there's stuff going on. And there's great excitement because you've got, you know, there's a kind of gangster detective thing going on in the, in the story as, as we try to work out who the bad guy is and where it's all coming from and you know, what will be the resolution. Um, and it came for me out of becoming a dad. I was, uh, my, my wife was pregnant with our first child when I wrote the first draft and then when I, I put the book aside and then our, our second child was being born when I finished the, the, the book entirely. So it came out of uh, not just the kind of idea of fatherhood but the kind of gut shot emotional turmoil of amazement and delight that is being a parent. So it, it's a very personal book for me and in consequence it feels maybe fractionally more serious and grown up but still I'm told very much the kind of book that I write and very recognizably me. So there we are.